Diffused Intrinsic Pontine Glioma, or DIPG, is a rare and inoperable brain tumor located in the pons region of the brain. Radiation treatment is possible, but costly and often does not fully eliminate the tumor. Phil Byrne joins us in the studio now to tell us more about a young boy affected by this disease. Yeah, that's right, Sarah. Uh, you know, in January, a young boy in mid-Michigan was diagnosed with the cancer, and a college baseball team stepped up to the plate to give the bright-eyed seven-year-old boy something to smile about. In January, Braden Buddy Miller was diagnosed with diffuse intrinsic pontine glioma, a rare and inoperable brain tumor. Radiation has um, still made him quite tired, so he tries the best he can to have you know, full energy and, and do all the fun things, but it's kind of hard for him sometimes. So the Spring Arbor baseball team hosted Team Buddy Day to help educate fans of Buddy's battle and to uplift his spirits while allowing Buddy to unofficially join the team for a day. They just fell in love and uh, Buddy is a, he's an enthusiastic, uh, just a big smile kid and just loves life. And so our guys love being around him and uh, so we just thought that it'd be just a, a really cool opportunity to, to celebrate Buddy. Buddy threw out the first pitch and later signed a letter of intent, heartwarming gestures to Jenny Miller, Braden's mother. That they're willing to take the time to follow his story and be involved and care enough to want to make a special day for him. It means more to us than we could ever express in words for sure. Nothing could have prepared the Millers for the challenges of coping with DIPG. And every day and really every moment is different. There's moments that he does, you know, he's absolutely fine and happy and then he just takes a turn and some days are wonderful just as it were they prior to this diagnosis. Other days are not so great. So we just, you know, embrace and enjoy every moment, but especially the, the happy, fun ones. The Spring Arbor baseball team also benefited from their newest teammate. I think that to have Buddy out here really puts into perspective that this is a game. Uh, we're talking about a seven-year-old boy that's fighting for his life, and uh, just to see his, his attitude towards life is great, and I hope our guys see that. The Miller family is still seeking help for radiation treatments on its GoFundMe page. For Buddy and his family, this battle against an incurable disease will be an everyday fight. Sarah? All right, Phil, thank you for that report. We appreciate it. Shortly after Phil put this story together, Buddy had an MRI, and there was a significant reduction in the size of the tumor after his latest radiation treatments.